Welcome back, everyone, to episode 18 of the City of Sanzibar. As you can see, I've done a little work off camera. Um, I did replace trees on these roads, uh, more tropical trees. Also, I uh, did a lot and a lot of experimenting to get this to work. Uh, even though this is an amusement park, it's also a pedestrian only area in order to get it to work so that all the people came in through our uh, gate and paid for admission I had to set this to a road that people couldn't walk on but the uh, the vehicles that service that area could drive up and go across and that was took a little time you see, yeah, we got some cop cars driving out there. Uh, lots of people walking in and out there. Uh, this little area I sort of uh, fleshed out. Uh, I put all of our regular services out here. The yeah. clinic and the police and fire and uh, the dead body grabbers and the little recycling center, even though that's not needed. With this being a uh, pedestrian only zone, um, this uh, building over here should take care of the garbage for this area. Uh, you can see here I have to make some adjustments to this, but I did run the uh, metro line out here from the airport. That was a single line going from downtown to the airport. I just extended it out here. Uh, so a straight line it seems to be working really well um this area we're coming in from the airport uh it's a good way of getting lots and lots of tourists in here you can see we're, we're doing quite well i replaced all of the uh paths in the uh down here with the uh, pedestrian walkways you see a hearse slowly making its way to pick up a dead body somewhere all the old rides that I had are still where they're at. I haven't changed that much. I did put up uh, the big castle up on that big flat area up on top. I think that looks really nice up there. And uh, I picked a uh, coniferous type wood to surround it with just up there on top. It seems to uh, play better with the, the architecture. The, uh, pine trees and everything. Uh, out here, I have a, a long pier. I'll just like to put some other things out here, pier-wise. But I did replace all of these uh, roads. Uh, one idea that occurred to me, and I, what I think I'll do today, is uh, a monorail. what I say? Monorail! Monorails are very attractive tourists. Get a monorail to follow this road around the island. It is a rather long way to walk for everybody. It's not too bad. I mean, they're willing to do it. You can see uh, they're they're walking just fine. But I think uh, a monorail would add a, a little zing to the amusement park air of this place. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I want to uh, people to go through the gate and then maybe onto the monorail. Might be uh, able to stick one monorail station like here. All right, let's try it. See what we can do. I'm just making it up as I go along, you know, usual. Just usual stuff. Oh, that's pretty good. It's got that buried pretty well. Alright, let's see what we can do. 
Might be able to adjust the length of this road a little bit. This seems to work. They can't go back this way and they can't come in this way to bypass the gate. They have to go through the gate and you see it's working. So I think if I was able to put a uh, monorail station there, we have uh, the ability to keep them going through the gates before they get on the monorail. Uh, let's run it a little bit here. I want to make sure nobody's trying to sneak their way. Nope, they're all turning around. That's good. All right. I haven't uh, messed with the monorails yet, ever, in this game, even on the previous cities that I made. Just no need for them, really. Metros are are just fine for making that all work. And uh, monorails are kind of expensive to put in. Uh, let's see. I think I can make this look a little bit better if we do that. Through the crosswalk there. Oh, and I did have to have this one little section of normal road that the people can walk out onto from a, a path to a road. Uh, this didn't work as a path to that. And it didn't work as a path to that, of course, because there's no sidewalks. Um, the only thing it worked is a, just a section of regular road there with sidewalks. And that uh, seemed to work. But I digress. What I'm going to do is take those two nodes, put that directly across from the entrance to the monorail. Uh, make sure it's still working here. Where are you going? Can't go down that way. And I am going to put crosswalk straight across that road there. Crossing. There we go. Don't know why I got that error, but who cares? Get all that lined up pretty. Right across the crosswalk into the monorail. I think it'll work. Great. And we got water. Great. And we still got four million dollars in the bank. Used up a lot of money uh, putting these pedestrian walkways down. They're very expensive. All right, where was that going to end up? Let's uh, give ourselves some turf to work with here. All right, metro station, metro station. Now we gotta have some room to get the uh, train in there. I think that's close. That'll work. Those uh, monorail lines um, can handle fairly tight curves. Just regular track, raised up. 
forward about. Hard to tell if I'm parallel with that road or not. There we go. Like I got a little lump in, lumpiness in it. destroying these buildings we need to go closer to the road See if we can tweak our way around this tree. off the road. Okay, that will do. Thinking to use the road as a a guide for laying out the track. I wanted to follow the uh, inside of the road. I'll use our parallel tool to do that. First we have to figure out where our other stations are going to be. Uh, right there between these two I'll give you a uh, access to this area once it's further developed and here and here and same thing out here I think that'll cover all of that area And let's see if cracks are on the inside. It's on the outside there. That 
one there. to think ahead of where I may be developing. Probably in here. And this short distance is fine. So I think that'll do. Alright, let's see if our parallel tool will get us close to what we want. Swap sides. Yeah, actually looks pretty good. Hit enter. And just tie these two together. I like the way it sort of smooths itself out there. And here we can get rid of that. Uh -huh. Superb. Excellent. You know, the same thing here. I'm going to go from there to there. Mesh these together. fine. We have some trees intruding there. We can get rid of them. Stretch that out a little bit. Come on. Hit the right button, if you please. some trees in the way here. Wouldn't you know it. Let's see if we add a... Also walk there. Yes. Excellent. And let's get our tree set. I was using California palms all along the road here. There. It even makes it look nicer because it's got trees closer together. Alright. Moving on. Okay, that's fine. That's the tricky part. Uh, let's see, out mm, there. There. All right. Keep a close. 
close eye on the uh, height adjustments there. Looks all good. All right then. Good. Go up the road. Here. We can do without that little hump there. down to ground level there. That's fine, though. Okay, we're still on the inside, so... Grab that. Parallel pull. Stay from here. Down to there. track there. Right, that'll do. All right, next section. Last. Section go from there. We may be able to tie them together there somewhere. Let's see what we can do. That's right, we're gonna be on the other side of the road, so I think we're gonna have to go around the back the hotel here. Rather sharp turn there. Let's see if we can smooth it out a bit. Severe. Uh, this road's all over the place here, isn't it? Why am I asking you? Go from here to there. That's better. And. There to there. Eat. What's the heights? All these nodes, it's too hard to get. Get them selected so close to each other. We are connected all the way around there. I think we'll go around, around the back. Uh, let's get rid of these trees.
All right. connected. We do have a little unnecessary rise there. See if we can do something about that. between those trees. Yeah, I'd come here as a tourist. Okay, we're gonna need, uh, I think, three lines here. One, just a simple back and forward get people into the park. And then a loop line in both directions. So two loop lines. I think there's only one vehicle I have to select. Oh, I think up two cars should be enough on that. It's a very short run there and back. Uh, one thing I may want to do here is set this intersection so that that one yields to the uh, short line. Because we have enough room here if we back up our trains um, in case they're waiting for this line to go through. Um, there's more room there to handle that stuff. All right, now our first loop line. And let's see, we got five stops. I think I'll four vehicles out there. And we want another line going the other way. Four vehicles, One, two, three, four. All right, let's get it running and let it assign colors. It's supposed to do it randomly, but randomness has failed it. These two colors are way too close together. Let's make that uh, pleasant dark green like that. There we go. Great. Comes a train in. Don't think anybody will be on it this early. They just started running. And we'll have to see if we got anybody. Uh... Oh, we got some customers waiting up here. Good. Yeah, here you go.
Yep. Looks good. And we're still getting a fairly good number of people who decide to take the walk, the pleasant walk. Boy, they really are uh, crowding up here. 122 waiting. Let's see how many we can get in that vehicle there. Yeah, took them all. And the next vehicle is coming right around. Great. That looks like it's running fine. I like being able to look right into the roof here. Okay, we have a bit of a crowd forming here. These uh, trains coming in from the main island there. Coming in a lot faster than the circle route trains can make it here. Let's make sure. As long as it doesn't go above 180, they should be able to pick everybody up. See how many it picked up here. Yep. It's doing fine. Next train is just behind there. So that shouldn't be a problem. Being used quite regularly. Uh -huh. Even got people taking that rather steep walk up the hill here. That roller coaster. How about up to our our castle? Yep. Why you ride their bike up into the castle? Yeah, I've got tourists all over the place there. Yeah, once we get more um, attractions out here, we'll be fine. And yep, got our cops on the beat. Just got some people out here on the pier. Let's see where we're at on our amusement park. Almost level two. Got more than enough visitors. have to add a bunch of a uh, bunch more amusement items to the park all the rides and stuff Just, we've got to fill this place up put everything we can down oh look we got a dead person this roller coaster has killed somebody again it's like the third one I've seen out here Let's see if the hearse makes it out here. Pick up the dead body. Yeah, there's the hearse right there. It's great. Speed limit on those roads. Rather, rather slow. But it's alright. As always, thanks for joining me. Nope, see you again tomorrow.